Hey guys, Ravi here. In this video, I am going to explain you how you can use the absolute path in React Native Projector. If you are still using the relative path of the component and the screen in your projector, uh, I am uh, importing my screen, home screen like this way, which is uh, inside the screen directory. And uh, suppose I moved this um, uh, folder or the file from one directory to another uh, directory then in this case it will create a problem and in this case uh, you have to change the relative path in each file where you have used this home screen or the component so therefore you have to use the absolute path in your project now So for that one you have to create a package.json file in your root directory so i am creating a package.json file inside the source folder here now inside the package.json file you have to use name and here you have to give the directory name so for my case I am using the source uh, src as a root directory so in this case uh, I don't need to use the relative path I can directly use source uh, src and then the screen is uh, inside this uh, source so I can use directly here so similarly in other screen also you can use uh, the absolute path so let run this project uh, and see is uh, any issues coming or not Now you can see that uh, the app is open. So you can see there is uh, no error uh, related with the component path. So by this way you can use absolute path in your React Native project also. Please comment uh, which method is your preferring relative path or the absolute path for your project. So there is uh, one more method to use the absolute path in React Native project. Uh, for that one you have to configure your uh, bible.config.js file but uh, that method is a uh, require additional uh, npm module for that one but this is uh, the easiest way to use the absolute path in your react native project therefore you can use package.json file and then just uh, name your directory name so hope you like this video please comment which path you are using relative path or the absolute path so thank you for watching this video we will meet in the next video thank you